to my Jamaican vibes. Sometimes I got to go back to the roots of the Don Hall boy. Yes, 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 know that. Yes, know that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, y'all, real quick, this is Nate SB back to you with another video. You know, you guys are my friends. Thank God for some subscribers. Whatever amount of subscribers I got is what I got. I'm using my platform. I'm just trying to be me, y'all. Please understand and respect that. Um, this is what I'm doing today. I'm going to do a quick two sneaker pickup that I had recently. Um, I really don't buy a lot of Pumas. But I walked into a store. I saw two pairs, two, and I had to pick up both. So this is just my quick little just letting you see what I bought for the low, right? Uh, these right here, these are called the... Puma, Future, I think it's like Foam Runner, Future Foam Runner, something like that, Future Runner, that's what it's called, Future Runner, I've seen a lot of people wearing these lately uh, here in New York City, um, I, I was just curious, you know, for $20, you can't beat this, shout out to Foot Locker, um, it has like these like off-white vibes, it's, you know, like look at the tongue, got the exposed tongue, got the little like weird, you know, tabs on here, and just... It has another tab over here, and honestly, I don't know what these plastico pieces are, you know, these little plastic pieces, but I picked them up. They were 20 cash. It didn't hurt. I did try them on, man. Like, this right here, like the sole, I don't know if you can see, it's like these little ridges that stick out uh, of the bottom. They're super comfortable, man. Like, when you step in, it's like it's molding to your foot. It feels weird. Um, it's, it's, it's a super comfortable sneaker. Um, I, 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 you know, I posted them on my gram. Uh, for those that want to see more pictures of what the sneaker looks like, uh, you know, with a better camera, you can go check out that gram. I would greatly appreciate you can follow me on Nate underscore SB. All right. The next one uh, I picked up was the Staple Pigeon. Staple Pigeon. Had to get another pair, man. I, I think I had posted a video about these before. And just, you know, just showing you the quality on this sneaker. Now I have dos. So now I can rock one and stock one, right? Because I'm a big staple pigeon fan. I love these, man. I love these, man. These I ended up paying $39.99 for a total of 60 cash for two pairs of sneakers, man. And yes, they're Pumas. I don't care. Right now, I'm just testing the boundaries. I feel like I'm a free agent in the NBA, and I'm just trying on all types of sneakers. You know, putting on some Puma, then I'm trying on some Nikes. The only thing I would never put on, y'all, is a pair of Vans to ball. And a pair of felines. I'm sorry, Jerry Stackhouse and Grand Hill. I understand you guys used to do that with the, with the felines. I just can't do it. I can't. Not right now. I need prayer. Deliverance when it comes to felines. But, you know, this is a quick little video. Just wishing y'all a happy Friday. Happy Saturday. I got a bunch of stuff. I just, I just don't have time to do videos, man. But I'm doing my best. It's good to see you guys. Make sure you leave a comment. Let me know how you feel. This is the Puma Future Rider. And we got the staple pigeon SB. You already know the vibes. Hold it down, hold it down. Hold it down.